Now, we've seen the different political sides saying that they have the majority of numbers in the National Assembly, which is significant because it then sets the precedent for positions and in terms of influence when it comes to agenda. Now, here, and this is on our ntvkenya.co.ke website, we have a representation of how the seats look in regards to parties. This is in regards to the political parties. This is not yet aggregated into coalitions. So, so far, as an individual party, United Democratic Alliance, sorry, let me take that again, UDA has uh, the largest number of uh, MP MPs or MNAs, the, the members of National Assembly, and that figure stands at 137. We have 137 uh, MNAs from UDA. From there we have uh, ODM, the Orange Democratic Movement Party, having um, 85. Um, let me just make it a bit more visible. Um, yeah, 85. Then we have Jubilee Party having 29 seats in the National Assembly. We have Wiper Party, uh, which has 24 seats. Um, then we have 12 independent, um, independent candidates who uh, secured seats in the National Assembly. Then we have Amani National Congress, Muslim Mudavadi's party, having seven seats. We have six in Ford, Kenya. We have five from Democratic Ac Action Party Kenya, that's DAP Kenya. Uh, then we have uh, KANU, Kenya African National Union, with five seats. We have five seats as well for the United Democratic Movement, UDM. Uh, we have four for the Pamoja African Alliance, that's PA. Mandeleo Chap Chap has two seats in the National Assembly. Uh, UPIA has two seats as well. Um, then we have the service party TSP, which has two seats, one of which is the party leaders, that's Mwangi Kionjuri. Then we have Movement for Democracy and Growth, MDG, has one seat in the National Assembly. We have United Progressive Alliance, UPA, which has one seat as well. We have Grand Dream Development Party, GDDP, with one seat as well. We have Chama Chama Shinani with one seat. National Agenda Party of Kenya, NAP Kenya, with one seat as well. National Ordinary People Empowerment Union, NOPEU, has one seat, as is the case with UDP and Democratic Party of Kenya, DP. Now, the four other seats which are represented there, which have been grayed out, represent the four constituencies whose uh, elections were suspended. And now these suspended elections, as we had indicated earlier on in Bridget's Ghana story, have been postponed indefinitely as the IBC chairman uh, decries different concerns, in, uh, which include harassment, arbitrary arrests, and even murder, saying that the staff are intimidated and are in, in fear for their lives. So that is how it looks like in regard to how the individual parties sit. There is a lot of um, you know, conversing to see how many of these can be moved into the coalition parties. And so uh, we are monitoring that and we shall be giving you the details once they are firmed up and confirmed. Back to you, Smriti.